happy Sears. Good morning. Day 25. It's breakfast time at the house. We're going to have breakfast sandwiches. I'm going to show you how I make them. I got my skillet on on the lowest heat for melt so it won't get too hot for my butter. I'm going to fix up my eggs. I'm going to use two of these extra large white eggs. I'm going to use salt. I'm going to take this off the eye so it don't get too hot. Some white pepper instead of the black pepper. I'm gonna whisk it with my fork. My countertop is cleaned off. Back on the eye while it's still warm on the eye. I'm going to wait a couple minutes for the eggs to start getting white around the corners. I'll be right back. You don't want it to get too fully cooked. You want it to be like a rounded, like more yellow in this center. You want the white to come all the way around the circle. Not too runny and not too crispy, but in a thin way. Hmm. I don't want to turn the heat up too high because it'll burn it. So I keep it near this center or in like here, just to be safe. So I can cook fast. And the bread I'm going to be using is the last of the brioche bread. It's sweet where you don't need no jelly. It's almost there. This is good. I'd like to show you how I make mama's coffee too. Okay, it's there. This is the consistency you want it. Now I'm going to add my pieces of bread on it. To know you can flip it is if you can move it. Can't move it yet, but you're close to it. I'm gonna let that wait for a bit so it can connect to these two. But this is the coffee I've been we've been drinking, Mardi, Mardi Gras King Cake. This is really, really good. It's not too sweet, which is good. Half of it's coffee. Next is mama's favorite creamer. It's zero sugar. I'm trying to think more health-wise. Then I add a little bit of syrup. that. This is mama's coffee. This is the kind I use for myself. It's really, really good. Now I'm going to flip it. This is what it's supposed to look like. It got a little bit burned, but it's not bad. I just want to add cheese to it. Colby Jack. You, you could use provolone or Swiss for it. This 
So I'm going to wait for a while. Wait for 10, 15 seconds for the cheese to melt. I'm going to turn it a little bit higher. Just a little bit. My cheese is almost melted. I'm going to put my meat bacon. this amount of bacon on it. I was using this packet to put my bacon on. And I'm going to flip it close. I'm going to add a little bit of jelly to my, just a little. Now I'm going to close it up. I need to do both hands. Here it is, flipped. It's like an omelet, but it's more like a sandwich. I'm going to wait till the cheese gets a little more melted on it. To show you how to make my coffee. Turn the heat down to melt. Here's my coffee. So how is everyone's morning? It's Wednesday. It's a beautiful day outside. No clouds. Looks it's supposed to rain. It's supposed to rain either this week or next week. I don't know. I need to check the weather. But I love the rain too. It's almost ready. I need to take it out. I'm going to cut it in half. I made another one of these sandwiches. Hers had Swiss in it instead of Colby Jack. There's the section. It turned out really, really good. Alright, BCers. Like, share, and subscribe. Hit the bell for notification. Thank you for watching. Have a beautiful Wednesday morning. Bye.